Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a review of my Valentino Rock Stud bag in a size small. And I'm going to show you what fits inside of it and the overall wear of the bag. So if this is something you're interested in, continue to watch. If you are new here, I'm Dianca and I discuss all things beauty, life, luxury, travel, unboxings, and reviews. So make sure you subscribe, like, comment, share. If you're already a subscriber, thank you so much for subscribing and let's get right into it. Okay, so what we have today is the Valentino Rock Stud bag and this is in the small size. Look at this bag. Isn't that just beautiful? This is the size small, and I believe that this is lambskin leather. It is so soft, but unlike other lambskin bags, you don't have to baby this one because with the spikes on here, I think the spikes kind of give it a little protection of you, you know, scratching it being able to scratch it too much although the spikes they are not they don't scratch you and they don't snag on your clothes at least i haven't had that experience yet that they snagged on my clothes but this bag is still even with the spikes very soft and very durable so you don't have to be extremely careful with it i love everything about this bag because of course if you've seen previous video videos of mine you know that i love top handle i love crossbody and i really love bags with chains because they kind of dress it up but this is to me like the perfect going out bag or date night bag especially if you just want to put on something simple and then dress it up this bag will definitely do it and for me it's the chain it's the hardware on the bag that just makes it extremely gorgeous. Um, you can also remove this chain if you want to, and you can also remove this top handle. So another thing I like about it is because it's so versatile. You can wear this as a long shoulder strap bag, which I'll include some shots at the end of this video. So you can see how you can wear this as a long shoulder bag, or you can double up the handle and wear it as a short shoulder bag. Um, I've seen how you can carry, um, some people wear it as a clutch where you can put your hand right through here and carry it as a clutch. Um, you can remove this strap. You can remove the long chain. I've also noticed that some people do not know how to remove the strap or the chain. If you want to remove this top handle, on these D-rings here, you have... There's a little space here. Let me turn it around so you can see. There's a little space on the D-ring where you can, let me turn it. You push it in. Can you see that on both D-rings? You push it in and then you are able to just remove it. You can do that to the other side also. And then to just put it back and then just put it back on. I personally like this strap on at all times because I love the look of it if it's facing that way. I love to carry it as a top handle. So for me, I'll probably always keep this strap on. If you want to remove this chain and just carry the bag as a top handle without the chain, you have to line these up just perfectly, just across from each other this way. Wait, let me turn it around so you can see it. You line these up and then you're able to slide them out this way. So one horizontal, one vertically, and then you're able to just get it right back in there. I've seen quite a few people who did not know how to remove that strap, but it did take me a minute to figure out how to remove this chain. But I personally also like to have the chain on because even if I'm carrying it as a top box, top handle, I like to have the look of the chain because to me that just dresses up the bag even more, the jewelry of the bag, and it makes my outfit stand out even more if you ask me. Um, let's see what fits inside of this bag. First off here, you have the little turn lock to turn it. On the inside, this fully lined leather. You have one pocket on the inside, which is a red pocket here you can fit 
slide a card or something back in that pocket there. And then on the inside, it's just open, but it's all leather lined. So I'm going to show you what fits inside of here because it's actually pretty roomy because this bag does have room to stretch. So I'm going to show you what, what I can fit in here. I have my six ring car holder. I have my YSL card holder. I said card holder for my key. I said my six ring key holder. And my YSL card holder. Then I also have this All Saints card card holder. Put that right in there. I have my perfume diffuser. And I have lotion. And then a couple of lip gloss. Lipstick and a lip gloss. All of that fits in there just perfect. Close it up. That's how it looks when it's pretty full. Let's see that. It's not stuffed. I can still fit something in there if I wanted to slide in another lip gloss or something like that. I never, I really don't carry my phone in my purse, especially if I'm carrying a small purse. Nine times out of ten, I don't put my phone in my purse. I usually have my phone in my hand or something like that. But this is perfect for me. It's not too heavy. It's just, just the perfect cute little bag. And so versatile. And this is the Valentino Rockstud bag in a size small. And that is what fits inside of my Valentino Rockstud bag. Next, I'm going to include some mod shots of the different ways that you can carry the bag. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, comment, share, and thank you for watching.